rally once again calling for local districts to reopen classrooms. Cap KVU's Neil Fisher talked to some of the protesters. Dozens of Tri-City students got together Friday afternoon to protest not being in classrooms. We're asking to reopen our schools, but in such a way that it's safe for us. The Washington Department of Health held a news briefing Thursday which showed graphs like this, which indicates students could be just as safe in remote learning as they would be in hybrid learning with countermeasures in place. There are, are no zero risk scenarios. Students in the Tri-Cities calling for change. We want to like get a point across to all the boards in Tri-Cities that kids are wanting to go back to school because not only is it affect affecting like our grades at home, it's also affecting our mental health. Students throughout the Tri-Cities plan to continue these protests. We do more rallies. We're going to rub shoulders with anyone we can to spread our words. Um, just come together as a, you know, Tri-Cities. Students have more rallies planned before the next decision for education is made by the Kennewick School District on November 18th. For more information, visit our website, yaktrinews.com. In Richland, Neil Fisher for Cap KVU Local News.